this looks good. Hello, the internet, Saffron here. And another game that I just happened to stumble across, Beast Breaker. And it looked right in line with my type of content. It had cute little animals and it was an RPG and the, the battle like mechanic looks kind of unique. Uh, but we're gonna check it out here. So new game. Oh dear. That can't be good. Poor little mouse guy. This this teardrop needs your help. It's an angry well, it's a geolocator, that's what it is, really. <laughs> Incoming transmission. One final time I asked you to raise your sword. The beast outside your farm has cornered me. Without intervention, I may not survive. Please. You can do it, little mouse. You're so cute. These little floof of hair and green eyes. It would... I would think it was an albino, but it has green eyes. So that kind of makes it not an albino right there. Ambushed by a shard nest tracks. Well, we're getting right into this. Select Desperate Strike to attack the beast. Okay. Aim with L. Rotate ZR. Whoop. Rotate aim CL and ZR. Oh, I can do that this way. I can. Okay, so I can do it either way. Uh, nudge aim. Uchi, uchi, uchi. Okay, so it's like kind of like a pinball thing, which I dig that. I'm all for that. Or even like billiards. Okay, so if I rotate... Okay, so it's the same. I'm sorry, I'm just trying to make sure I got this all squared. All right, let's do that. Hey, I did it! This is a core. Cores take several hits to destroy. These are scales. Scales can be destroyed with one hit. So it's like a mix of brick breaker. I love it. I love it. <laughs> I get it now. It makes sense. Okay, if your health drops to zero, battles that number of actions remaining this turn. So I can still do one more. So if we kind of switch it down just a little about the same place where we were. Nudge, 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 nudge. Ha ha! You're out of actions. Press the end turn button to continue. Okay, well, I guess I have to end turn. Scales grow back every turn. Navigate to GRW to find out more. Okay, shard beasts have weak scales. A beast element determines the shape, composition, durability, and some things, even behavior. And the number of scales the beast will grow at the start of your turn. Oh, okay. Well, that sucks. Destroy the core. Okay, so then if I go... Yeah, I can't really do that yet. I really just have to go down this way, huh? But yeah, then it's just a matter of kind of bouncing back and forth. But you really got to get in there then, huh? It's nudging, nudging, nudging. Yeah, and this angle is bad. This is a bad angle. Oh, there we go. Whoops. I was there and then I, I, I fudged I fudged a bit. We were there. Hold on. Now we got to nudge. All right. Okay, now we're there. And then if we come in here, I th can we just get, do we want to take the hit? We want to break the walls or whatever, because he's going to get two back though. So we might as well just go in and see, maybe we can get, oh no, that's not exactly what I wanted. I mean, he'll and then the, did you see the core had seven? That's a thing. Cool. I am digging this so far. So if I do this, and then if I go back in here and try this again. Oh, come on. I'm going to have to figure out the best way that I want to control this. Okay. Yeah, look at that. Can't get me over here. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Okay, I'm digging this. I'm digging this. It, it takes a little thinking here. 
I gotta decide what I wanna do better, the L or R or the uh I gotta uch it. Uch uch uch. There I broke his head! His head is broken. Did I stop it? Skipper, huh? S stranger, you safe? Um, no one's here. Who sent that message? Should I get Granny's sword back before... <gasps> yes, before things? It has another head! Oh. Oh, high leader of the guard is attack zone. Navigate to attack to find out more. Okay, if you're in the, the, the... Okay, yeah, that makes sense. If you're in the highlighted area, you're gonna get hit. Right. Oh, hello. No, Skipper! Quick, wins, widen your stance. Balance the blade now. Strike the core. Well, yeah, that was kind of... The core mark with plus is the vital core. Make sure you destroy it. Okay. I mean, it makes sense. Can I get in there and just bounce around for a little bit? Yeah! And then I'm safe from its attack to boot, but now I'm way out here. This is bad. This is a bad spot, though. Um, so if I bounce... Hopefully I have enough room? Well, I suppose I can bounce from the back, right? Yeah, let's do that. Hey, that works! And then we're out of harm's way, and we did some damage! If I uch it... If I uch it this way... Nope, that's going to be too much of an angle, I think. Here, let's just do that. That should give us two more hits, right? <gasps> Ooh, we got to get out of there, though. <laughs> we don't want to be in there. That's the one thing is I don't know exactly where I'm going to end up. I am assuming that maybe that'll come in to play later as like an additional ability or something, but we're going to see, right? Ha! Look at that. I wasn't 100% planning it that way. I figured I'd get the two hits, but we'll take the three. Skipper, someone was in trouble. Anyone with a lick of scent should have sought shelter at the first beast football. Only a fool runs towards the danger. They called for help. <sighs> you have a good heart. We'll talk about my sword later. Right now, we need to get our tails back to the farm before we risk a rampage or... Things! Change of plans. We're talking about the sword now. <laughs> nice. Oh, we just get into another fight right away. We're just going right into it. Oh, um, stay nimble and make calculated strikes to prepare for a stronger attack. Okay, so if I do this and if I start just bouncing between crap. Yes, like that. <laughs> I am digging this game. <laughs> You're all charged up. Now impale it with your sword point. Pierces everything on every step, while inside a scalar core deal one damage. Okay. I'm kind of in a bad place to use this, though. Because my first bounce, well... Oh, I go through everything, though. So I can just kind of... This. Yeah! Cool! And then it resets. The farm's right in its path. Take out one of the cores to stop it. Well, I'm doing my best, Granny. Beast will rampage unless you stop him. Navigate to the Ravage counter to find out more. Oh, it's six turns. Okay. Pretty obvious. Got it. Okay, so then... Can we squeak in here? Haha, <laughs> because we're a mouse, we squeak. Or do we want to go up here and try to do some damage? Yeah, let's do that. Nice! Rampage reset. And I'm still out of harm's way. That distracted it. Destroying a core lowers the beast's growth rate, too. Excellent! Killing the core distracted the beast. Navigate to Ram to find out more. Yeah, but Rampage is in seven turns. I get it. I get it. Okay, so then... Okay, how come I'm stuck now? Oh, because it's making me navigate. All right, so it made me navigate. I'm like, I understand what's happening. How come I can't just attack now? Okay, so... Okay, I get it. All right. Okay, there we go. <laughs> I got a little hiccup there. 
No rest for weary paws. Strike the vital core. End this now. Excellent. I will do my best. Strike. See ya. Can I get in there from the back? I think I can. We're gonna find out, right? Oh, no, whoops. Didn't quite work, but that's okay. We're fine. We're fine. Oh, I can do impale now. We'll just go right through it. Or do I? Well, we have it. Let's... <coughs> Excuse me. Let's impale, and then we strike, and we can bounce around. Oh, we are just right there, huh? Okay, let's... I don't want to end up, like, right in... Like, right in its blast zone. And that's what's going to happen if I do this, I think. So I think we're going to have to just play it safe. And go from the back. There. Awesome, we're good. So where do we want to strike now? I think we're going to come over here. I like that idea. All right, now we got to be a little more careful. Oh, we can just do impale again. Let's just impale. Just run right through it, and then we'll be out of harm's way again. Sweet. <laughs> okay, so then if we come up here... Whoops. Way too far. Hold on. Hold on. Yeah, let's do that. Awesome. Reset that. Reset there. Sweet. Oh, and I can do impale again. And then that should finish it off. I, the music, too. The music is really good. So far, I mean, obviously we haven't seen much. Hey, I got shimmers and blossoms. Beast broken. Yay. You see what comes of taking risks? That cousin of yours is a bad influence. Oh, that glittering. I haven't seen moats like this since I was a scrap of a thing. How did the beast keep them inside it when the rest of the magic was chased away? I need to fire up the forge immediately. To fix something? No, or perhaps, maybe I should try to give her more of a voice. I'm not generally voice acting. New weapon available, sword and shield, hey! Hearth, kitchen. Oh, cool. Forge. Oh, I guess we're in the forge now. I wanted to check out the cellar too, but okay. These molds from inside the beast. I haven't seen their like for, for over a generation. See how they shine so much more than the faint flickers we get around the crops? I don't understand it. Still, waste not, what not. Check your bag. <gasps> They've tangled into a spark already. Not surprised. Back before, we'd find one almost every time we went out wandering. The magic was that plentiful. They were always worth gathering up because sparks need to be untangled. If we help the magic flow again... Here, I'll show you what I mean. Craft! A shimmer spark! Blossom spark! Okay. Oh, I can craft clothes or weapons. I see. Uh, let's craft. Sturdy stitch tunic. Let's craft there. Or not. Now the moats are free to replenish the world, but they've left some of their power behind in this equipment. Excellent. Unlock new sword and shield. Strike, spot, flaw, defensive charge, shield bash. X to inspect. Deal one damage, gain. Apply on core bonds, apply cracked. Crack cores take two damage. Oh, two plus damage. Deal one damage, gain one block. Consumes all block plus five step. Well, I'm sure we'll understand more about that later. Deal two damage. The fire lit, the sparks crackling. It's like being back there again, forging a new blade and watching a relative nearly get killed to get themselves killed. You said you saw a critter and thought they needed help? No, someone asked. With this, one of those? They started showing up the past few days. Looks like trouble to me. I've been locking them in the cellar. <laughs> oh, okay. To the cellar then. A whole box full. Ah, oh, one's still moving. Plan expedition. Okay. Oh, there we go. It wasn't working for a second. I don't know why. 
Fire the citizen danger time puts his new sword to the test. Renown level one. Okay. Let's go. You're grown now, and I'm well used I'm well used to having warnings ignored, but I'll say it regardless. The world is always be filled with critters in trouble. I don't want you to be one of them. Even if magic might still be out there. Take the better sword at least. Okay, how do I equip? Oh, there we go. Equip. Tunic. Equip. Sword. Shellcracker. All right. Depart. We are on our new adventure. Oh, hello you. Ambushed by a shard tusk crawler. Rushing in heedlessly makes for a fool's fight. Tailor your attacks to the gear you've got. Your new armor has a special ability that modifies a piece of the beast. Navigate to the bonus action to find out more. Gain one action when you damage this tile. Bonus tiles are randomly assigned to a beast skill at the start of your turn. Okay. Oh, is that what the, that gold tile is then? So then we can just strike and then we'll find some place to really ping pong in there. Or pinball in there, I guess. Yeah, like that. <laughs> I dig this. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, whoops. Well, that. Oh, no. Ooh. <laughs> that was close. <laughs> Oops. Use your shield. Offensive charge will prepare you to block incoming attacks. I don't want to use my shield, but okay. You insist. Oh, that was kind of rough, wasn't it? Um, yeah, because now we're out here and this is a bad spot. <laughs> oh, whoops. <laughs> Guess it's a good thing I did that. <laughs> All right, let's get a little better shot here. Uh, now we're stuck back here again. Wow, okay. Um, that's okay. Shield bash. Plus consumes all block. Plus five steps for each block consumed. So let's do this. Nice. More moats. Scamper quick to gather them. Oh, when you destroy a card, it will spawn moats. You have three turns to collect them before they disappear. Oh, okay. So that kind of adds a little extra thing to it. Let's do this, though. <laughs> that was kind of nice. All right, so let's get it. Oh, okay. Granny wants to be able to blocking power for defense. But could I ch challenge it, channel it into a shield bash instead? Maybe? Let's see, let's... Oops, let's... Other way here. Mmm, I'm debating what I want to do. Let's do that. Well, Placid. Yeah, let's do the Shield Bash then. Because, well, I did that before anyway, so we know what, we, what it did. Um... Actually, let's hold on. I want to do the defensive charge instead. Because I think, yeah, I'm like, I can get that boat, I can get in there, I can start bouncing around and do some damage. Oh, plus, I had the shield to block because I ended up kind of where I didn't want to be. Patience pays off. If you spot flaws in the beast core, you'll do more damage with each blow. Oh, I guess I haven't used the spot flaw yet. So let's just get in here. This way, this way, please. Keep going a little too far. Butch, inchy squinchy. Can I get off that four? Yeah, that's what I want, I think. Yeah, right there. I like that. We'll see what happens. Oh, I get stuck back there again. <laughs> that's what happens. Dang it. All right, well, we'll just strike again. I don't know if I can get past that claw now. I kind of screwed the pooch on that one. Oh, there we go. 
Hey, that worked out well enough. Okay. Well, let's do the spot flaw. They wanted to do the spot flaw. Let's do it. Let's see if I can't... Oh, nope. Can't quite get in there. We'll do that, though. Oh, really? That was nothing. <laughs> I guess we botched that, didn't we? <laughs> All right, we'll just get in here like this. We're still good as far as damage is concerned. Rampage in four turns. I'm going to have to start really doing something, huh? Okay, so let's get rid of this core. That should reset the Rampage. And we've got the one on the right also. Nice! Now we have all sorts of stuff that we got to collect also. Okay, let's do a defensive. Yeah, let's do that. Cool. All right, and then, yeah, if we take a strike and we bounce off of this. Oh, that's, ooh, that's kind of an icky angle. If we go just a little higher, can we get it? Maybe. We're going to find out. Nice! Got them both. Oh, and then we're right in here, aren't we? Can we get in there? We can get in there. Can't? Oh, we can't? Oh, we're just a hair too close. Oh, wait. Nope, nope. There it was. There. That's what I'm looking at. Yes, that's what I'm looking at. <laughs> that would have been nice if I could have just kept bouncing. Um, where do we want to go next? Let's do a defensive and see if we can't. <clears throat> Whoops. Oh, I bumped it just as I hit the A button. Uh, it worked out, but that's not exactly what I wanted to do. Uh, let's go. I don't want to be in his attack range, so let's just kind of bounce up here. Whoops. Oh, we had the block, so we're okay. We're okay. There. Do this. That was bad. That was bad, I will admit. Let's do a defensive. I kind of wish I still had my impale. That was nice. Nice. Missed it there. Okay, and then we just have a strike. Let's do this. Um, yeah, we're going to get to see if we can't start breaking him down. Oh, that was a bad place to stop. Because all I have is a strike, and guess what? We're not doing much. Well, we got a hit in. Good thing we had our block again. Okay, let's see if we can't get a little more bouncy action going here. Well, we did. Again, we got caught behind that claw. Okay, we're running out of kind of bouncy things here. Okay, whoop, whoop, hold on, hold on, hold, hey, hey. Stop it. <laughs> I gotta remember my little uchi keys. Yes, and I am playing this on the Switch. They did have it in the Epic Store, but then I had to get the Epic Store. I don't wanna. Nice. Rampage reset. Not that I was really worried. So far, it's been okay with the Rampage, but I'm sure that will change as we progress. Okay, it takes care of that. Go on with that. <laughs> the poor thing isn't going to have anything left. <laughs> okay, um, we need... Well, let's get our XP out of there, or whatever that is. Nice. Poor thing is just all exposed. Here, let's do a defensive charge just in case. Yeah, we're fine. We're fine. Okay. And it's gone! Yay! And I got a placid and a tangle. Beast broken. I broke it. Breaking beast. Okay, let's go to the forge quick. We got placid spark. And tangle sparks. Let's see what we can craft. Oh, I guess we're crafting that. 
Ooh, steal nerves and retaliate. Okay, yep. Um, deal two damage, add four taunt. If this is the first boss, increase attack by two. When beast taunt bar is filled, ram of the beast is increased by the one. Rampage counter does not go down. Oh, if you end your turn in the highlighted area, the beast will attack you for this much damage. On the first bounce, deal three damage. The beast lands attacking you, deal damage equal to its attack to the attacking core. The start of your turn, lose one retaliate. Interesting. Okay. Oh, hello. You're not the one I expected to answer my message. I kind of thought there was a shadow on the map, but I just kind of ignored it. Anyway, you, you're stranger you tried to help, yes. Tell your grandmother to meet someone named Cinnabar, that they're a mail carrier of sorts, and that they bear missives from those in desperate need of... Who? Where are they? You get her, aren't you? There's a bee stalking a settlement at the furthest edge of Bramble Hollow. So now, the only question is, what do you plan to do about it? We will do that next time. And then I was like, I saw the jar there. It looked like brains. Grandma's got brains in her basement. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. If you liked it, ring that bell, subscribe, leave a comment, all that good stuff. Otherwise, I hope you enjoyed it, and I will see you all later. See